Hey everybody, so this is Kiki and I'm back with a quick part one review video. I actually did this video um, a couple days ago and it was having some issues being viewed so I wanted to redo it really quickly. I'm going to be getting a sew-in at the end of this week and um, I just wanted to give some info on the hair that I will be using for the sew-in. I'm going to be using a premium nail human hair and this is 100% hair. 100% human hair and this is um, by Sensational and it comes in yellow packaging it says new Yaki platinum hair and the also tag is hanging says it is tangle free so this is how the hair looks and in my opinion it looks like extremely healthy African American perms hair and I got it in color 1B and I got two 14 inch packs. I paid around like $44 per pack. Um, it was $47 but the lady gave me I guess a discount. Um, it, was, it wasn't it was easy to find. I had to call around and go to a couple of beauty supply stores to find this hair. But I found it. It's not a lot of info on YouTube about it. It's just a couple of videos. Um, as far as hair sisters, where I go and I read those comments and reviews on the hair, they have pretty good reviews. For they say for the price point, it's a really good quality hair. Um, the one negative thing that I did see repeatedly was that the hair does shed. The girl who does my sewing, she doesn't cut the weft when she sews in my hair, and I know sometimes when you cut the weft, that can contribute to shedding. So we'll see how my sewing goes. Um, as far as my hair today, the last couple videos that you saw, I was doing wig reviews. So after that, that weekend, I actually flexi set my hair once again. I used all of the same products um, that I used the first time. If you want to know about the products I used, it is in the video. I do have a video on that. And um, so what I did today, I just picked out the curls a lot. I used some jojoba oil while picking out my curls. I use my organic root stimulator edge control to smooth out my edges and I twisted this part up. I like the curls wild and um, but still I like smooth maintained curls. I don't like a lot of frizz. So I'm really feeling this hairstyle. I like it a lot. It's like a curly afro but um, at the same time it when I flexi set my hair it takes me a while to roll it. Probably like an hour and a half to two hours. That's a long time to be standing and rolling your own hair um, also sitting under the dryer I do not like I'm not a fan of that so I just really need a break from doing my own hair and that's why I'm getting another sewing I like sewing as protective styles and to help my hair grow I'm probably about four and a half close to five weeks post perm I'm trying to stretch my perm as far as possible I don't know how long I'm going to be able to stretch and you guys see I have very thick hair um, just very thick coarse hair so I always have a hard time stretching I think the longest stretch I've ever did was around 11 weeks so I'm just really trying to gain length with my hair and I'm trying to get my ends healthy the right side of my head my ends are very frizzy porous I'm not sure to describe it but this side of my hair has issues and this side is smooth and doesn't. So I've been trimming my ends, but if I were to cut off all the damaged ends, my hair would be lopsided. So I'm just slowly cutting it. I just want it to grow and then slowly trim away the damaged ends. So um, stay tuned for more hair updates for part two of the premium nail hair. And um review. I'm going to be showing you guys my sewing. I don't know if I'm going to get a center part or I don't know. We'll see. I want to do something different with this sewing. So again, thanks for watching and hi to all my new subscribers. Thank you for subbing to me and um, I have a lot of fun exciting new hair videos and other videos to come. So thanks again for watching. Bye.